Emotional night indeed for the Cunningham sisters. Kayla, congratulations. The Parkland boys soccer team is one game away from finishing the LVC regular season undefeated. Only Whitehall can spoil the party tomorrow on the Trojans' home field. Parkland already assured the number one seed in the upcoming conference tournament, traveling to Northampton last night. And as Tom Mikrantz reports, came away with yet another shutout victory. Parkland went into last night's contest with 13 overall wins. Northampton had a respectable 7-3-2 LVC record and was hoping to make a statement on senior night. However, it was the Trojans again making a statement on why they're ranked third in the state by the Pennsylvania Soccer Coaches Association. After the Concrete Kids pressed early, Parkland was the team making the shots on goal, six total in the first half, while Northampton had zero. Credit Kids keeper Corey DeSasaris for keeping the ball from getting inside his net. Halftime came with no goals scored from either team. Trojans looked like they would break the scoreless tie minutes into the second half. Bilal Muhammad is stopped. Colin McConnell follows it up but misses on the left side. Then in the 47th minute after two players get tangled up, junior Paul Khalil collects a loose ball and shapes a kick from 27 yards out, screened by Parkland defenders. Trojans on the board, one to nothing. Parkland capitalizes on a turnover with over 18 minutes left in the game. Hal pushes the ball on top to Mohamed, who has no one but Disa Saris to beat, which he does for the Trojans' second goal. The 2-0 score would hold up as the final as Parkland outshoots the Concrete Kids 11-0 for its third win in a row. A defense that has given up just six goals in 16 overall games shines once again for head coach Patrick Burns. In the beginning of the year we were playing with eight guys, you know, ten guys, and they finally got back to what we were doing before, defending in the attacking third, defending in the middle third, and, you know, getting everybody involved in the defense, and, and that's, that's, that's why we don't give any shots up. It's not just our four, four backs, it's uh, everybody getting involved, taking pride on uh, playing defense. Yeah, the, the defense helped us out so, so much in this game. Our outside backs got involved in attack, and uh, our whole defense just played great. Nothing got through them, it was great. While the Trojans remain undefeated, they were coming off two straight ties. They're only two non-wins of the season so far. Those two ties came against Central and Easton. Since then, Parkland beat Nazareth and Exeter, and now Northampton. If we do get by Whitehall, you know, the fact that uh, we had uh, two ties on our record kind of helped us out, and I think it's motivated these guys. So, um, you know, they're ready to go. They're, they're a little irritated that uh, we uh, had those two ties, and I think they're motivated for the playoffs. Northampton closes its LVC schedule tomorrow at Nazareth. On the scene at Northampton High School, Tom Mikrantz, Two Sports. Terrific regular season there for the Trojans, but their season will be defined by what happens over the next couple of weeks. Yeah, indeed, they've had that uh, undefeated season a couple years back and lost in the Soccer district championship to Soccer can be a game. Exactly. When we come back, <laughs>